Today you will learn about the grid element. The grid helps you organize the content in columns and rows. The columns automatically adjust content for mobile devices, making your site mobile-friendly. Add Grid Click any round blue plus icon to open the Add panel or press Alt-G. In the Grid section, select a layout and choose the first option in which content is different. If the content layout in columns is the same, you can choose the second option, which will add the grid repeater element. We will talk about it in another video. Add content to cells. Click in the area of cell 1 and press Alt-I to add an image. Expand the image to the cell background by clicking the Expand icon. Click somewhere in cell 2 to select. Hold the Alt key and press the 2, T and B keys to add the heading 2, text and button elements. Click on the cell space to switch to the cell. Center all cell elements simultaneously by clicking the alignment icons in the property panel. Change the cell fill to light yellow by choosing the color on the contacts toolbar. Select cell 1. Click the image fit icon on the contacts toolbar and change the zoom and crop. When finished, click the Apply icon. Click and drag the grid bar to move the grid. Resize the grid by dragging the round corner marker. Center the grid in the block with the alignment icons in the property panel. Duplicate the cell by clicking the option in the menu. Click the arrow icons on the Contacts toolbar to move the cells in a row. You can find more cell operations in the Options menu. The Property panel for the cell contains the grid properties as well. You can expand the grid to the screen by clicking the white icon. Click on the icon again and collapse the grid, making it boxed or sheet-wide. You can also choose another layout from the list. Grab the image cell sidebar and drag the cell to reorganize the grid. Change the spacing between the cells by dragging the slider. You can add borders to the grid cells. Add the shadow to the image if needed. Switch to the phone view. You see that columns moved one below another automatically to adjust your site content for mobile phones. Change the height of the cell with the image on the background. Preview or publish the site to test. We have finished the lesson about the grid element. Subscribe to our channel and follow us on Facebook, Twitter or LinkedIn. Thank you for watching.